Visible light is the light that we can see with our very own human eyes. It is a combination of many different colors. When you see a rainbow, it's part of the sun's spectrum spread out by water. Each color has a different wavelength. Red is the longest and violet is the shortest. Altogether, these colors or these wavelengths are only 1% of the electromagnetic spectrum. So imagine all the colors in a paint store are only 1% of this entire spectrum. See, it's a range of all types of electromagnetic radiation. Wait, what? Radiation? Sounds scary, but it's not really. The sun emits all these various types of radiation. Once filtered through the Earth's atmosphere, sunshine is mostly a combination of infrared, visible, and ultraviolet frequencies. Radiation is energy that travels and spreads. We can see the effects of these traveling waves in our everyday lives. Radio waves, emitted by radio stations, carry music through the air. Microwave radiation cooks your popcorn, and in my case, most of my dinners. Infrared is used to change the channel on the TV. Ultraviolet will give you a sunburn, but it's also what makes black lights look so spooky. X-rays are useful when you visit the doctor for a broken bone. Plus, gamma rays can be used to see inside your body. But gamma rays are also my favorite because they're super high energy. The biggest gamma ray generator of all is the universe. In fact, a gamma ray burst is a short-lived explosive burst of energy that may form a neutron star, quark star, or even a black hole. Since we're not able to travel to a star or take samples from a galaxy, we rely on the electromagnetic radiation to carry information to us from distant objects in space. So when scientists peer into the universe or look at the sun, if they use only their naked eyes, they would be missing a lot of information.